Hi guys and welcome to DIY with Nadia. So today's video is going to be a tiny bit different. It is going to be a collab that is titled five things I thrifted and use every day collab. Now this is hosted by the lovely Carol from My Blessed Nest and co-hosted by Vaughn from Ginger Chick Rehab. I love both of these YouTubers and I will list their channels down below so please check them out. For my five, I'm going to get started with the most used to the least used. So the most used is actually the chair that's in the back of me. I have it covered by a furry white kind of cover just so it kind of looks nice in the background if, if it ever shows up. But it is this gorgeous blue leather chair that was actually thrifted by my mom and given to me. Now, I don't know how much she paid for it or... Um, I, I just don't know and I don't want to lie to you guys, but it was given to me by my mom and she thrifted it downtown Chicago that I know. So this is something that is used daily, every day. I'm in my office, literally if I'm not in the kitchen or in my bedroom, I'm in this chair. So that is number one. Number two are these salt and pepper shakers and these are marble salt and pepper shakers you guys check out how gorgeous these are and I got these on a, at a garage sale three dollars for both of them and they were I looked at them and I was just like I'm like this is marble and so she's like oh just three dollars because you could tell I don't know if you can tell there's scratches on top of this and when I got them they were filthy like filthy so I did some serious cleaning I mean I, and I remember it took me like three times especially like around the tops and around this area I wanted to make sure that it was clean you know clean 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 before I can use them at home but this is a pepper grinder and uh, there you go and it they're heavy you guys they're heavy because you know they're marble and this is the salt shaker and I absolutely love them you can see the marbling right there I absolutely love them and use them every day for three dollars seriously yeah so that is number two number three um, it kind of almost looks like I think it's handmade, hand blown. Um, I'll show you right here. It's so, so beautiful. It does have like these little rivets, kind of like almost like a, you know, like cigar um, plate or something it would be. But it's so big that, you know, it's not for that. I actually love this color so much. And I use it as a candy dish or when I want keto, like I'll throw almonds in there or something. And I just have this on my kitchen table or somewhere on the counter. And when guests are over, I'll just throw in something sweet and put it on the coffee table. It is just so, so beautiful. I know my diva light is blinding a little bit, but I wish you guys can see the iridescence of the colors here. It is so stunning. I'm so in love with this dish. And this I got at Goodwill. I think it was like around $2. I took the tag off. Um, it was like $2 at Goodwill. Not bad at all. Another thing I got at Goodwill are these vases, you guys. Vase number one and vase number two. They're a uh, set. And they look kind of spaceshipy. They look very retro, kind of, I don't know, 80s or something. But I love them. Especially this one. It's it just, you know, it's so perfect because it's black. And then I'll pu put in some gorgeous pink flowers or something here. And it's just it, it just pops so much. Because everywhere in my house I have white walls or like white background somewhere. So if you put this against white and some pink roses, just think about it. Just, just imagine the beauty. It is absolutely stunning. 
So here is one and they are pretty, pretty long. So this one is 12 inches and they're pretty much, and this one's 13. This one's a little higher. And this one's 13 and so it has two, and this is like see-through. I don't know if you guys, let me see. If you can. Oh, there you go. And it has these two openings right there and right there. And these little things, it's just easier to show in this one. They're see-through, these little glass things. It's just so, so beautiful. I love these vases. The last item, I'm going to kind of use it as one because they're a set of four. And I got these at an estate sale for $10. Um, I don't know if this was a steal. I'm not really sure. But I got these because I love Norman Rockwell. And so when I saw these, I thought I have to have them. And these are little mugs. I'm going to show you one at a time. This is the first one. Here is the second one. And I got a set of four. I don't know if they're valuable, no clue. I love this one and I love the comedy that Norman Rockwell has in his painting. It kind of fits, it fits my personality where it's kind of like a serious situation. Not, not serious, but like getting a shot and you just see so many other things going on and it's funny and it's, you know, it's cute. And here's, here's one with a doctor and the little girl. It's so cute and the doctor's listening to the little doll. I mean, it's just so much. And it does have the something, I'll read it what it says. It says 1929, the Saturday Evening Post. I don't think they were valuable. I think they were one of those, you know how on TV, they'll sell you this much for this much and order today. And it, I don't know if it was an infomercial. I have no idea how this person came to have them but I just I just thought they were so adorable and since I'm a huge fan of Norman Rockwell I could not pass these up so I do these display these I have not used them per se so these are kind of everyday decoration I don't know if I um, if that's okay but I mean you could use them if you wanted to I just this is too tiny for me I use <laughs> huge mugs like this like this one is from the Great Smoky Mountains but I drink coffee or my teas in huge mugs but anyway um, so this is my number five well if you sticked around this long thank you so much for watching I do appreciate it and I will see you guys in my next video bye Mwah.